Hello everyone, welcome to Park Mess. In this video, I am going to solve this interesting square root math problem. That is, square root of 50 times 51 times 52 times 53 plus 1. So to solve this question properly, first we will write solution and we will write this question in the solution again. So the question is, square root of 50 times 51 times 52 times 53 plus 1. And next step, we can write 51, 52 and 53 as is equal to square root of 50 times 51 can be written as 50 plus 1. Similarly, 52 can be written as 50 plus 2 times 53 can be written as 50 plus 3 and plus 1. Next, as we are looking that there is 50 present in every term. So let us suppose this 50 is equal to let 50 is equal to y. So we will replace 50 in this equation with y. So this equation will become is equal to square root of y times y plus 1 times y plus 2 times y plus 3 and plus 1. In next step, let us combine these two expressions with each other and these two expressions with each other to get a product. So it will become is equal to square root of y times y plus 3 parenthesis close times combine these two terms y plus 1 times y plus 2 parenthesis close plus 1 let us multiply the expressions inside the braces. So it will become square root of y times y is y square plus y times 3 is 3y times y times y is y square y times 2 is 2y 1 time y is y and 1 times 2 is 2 plus 1. And next if we will simplify this polynomial inside the braces. So it will become square root of we will write this as the same y square plus 3y braces close and y square plus 2y plus 1y is 3y plus 2 braces close plus 1. In this equation as we are looking at y square plus 3y are same. So let us suppose this is equal to let y square plus 3y is equal to k. So we will replace y square plus 3y with k in this equation. So it will become square root of this will become k times and this is k plus 2 k plus 2 and plus 1. 
Now, let us multiply these two polynomials. So, it will become square root of k times k is k square plus k times 2 is 2 k n plus 1. Now, here I will try to make this in algebraic identity. So, we can write this equation as k square plus 2 times k times 1 plus and we can write this one as 1 square. So, here we will use the algebraic identity that is a square plus 2 times a b plus b square is equal to a plus b whole square. So, by using this algebraic identity, we can write this equation as square root of it will become k plus 1 whole square. So, here this square and this square root will be cancelled with each other. So, only k plus 1 is left. But as we previously considered that k is equal to y square plus 3y. So, we will replace k with y square plus 3y. So, it will become y square plus 3y plus 1. But as we previously considered that y is equal to 50 in the start of this problem here 50 is equal to y. So, in this equation we will replace y with 50. So, we will do the further steps here. First, we will write that equation that is y square plus 3y plus 1. So, here we will put the value of y that is 50. So, it will become 50 square plus it is 3 times y. So, the y of value the value of y is 50 plus 1. No, 50 square is to multiply 52 times. So, multiplying 52 times we will get 2500 plus 3 times 0 is 0 and 3 times 5 is 15 and plus 1. Now, let us add these 3 numbers 1 plus 0 plus 0 is 1, 5 plus 0 is 5 and 1 plus 5 is 6 and 2 will become here. So, 2651 is the answer and solution of this interesting square root math problem. And in last, don't forget to subscribe our YouTube channel for the solution of viral math problems and math Olympiad questions. Thank you so much for watching. Take care. Bye bye.